Hi, today we're going to do a field test of the model railroad throttles that we've been working on. Welcome to another episode. Less than a month ago, as I mentioned in my previous video, several of us got together at TCS headquarters to work together on the model railroad throttles. At the end of the week, actually on Friday, we took a, a field trip to do a field test of our throttles as well as the command station at a, another model railroad. Uh, and I have to look it up, it's uh, Rich Murray is the name of the person uh, who hosted us. He has a very nice layout. And what I'm going to show is uh, basically what the, the session looked like. Uh, in the beginning we had to set up a uh, Wi-Fi router because uh, Rich doesn't have Wi-Fi at his house. Uh, and then we got our command station installed in place of the one that he has. And then we started to run trains. So let's head on over to Rich's layout. I like that with a speedometer on that's, that's, that's good. See, that's actually showing you a speed step, not miles per hour. Yeah. But would but, you? But, but we're actually talking about having a feature where it shows you scale miles per hour. Would you like that? Yeah, that'd be kind of nice, yeah. But like you say, especially for diesels, when you're noxious, you have different throttle notches, too. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. It's a little more realistic, you know. Mm-hmm. So Rich is really liking his throttle. Aren't you? Yeah, I do like this one. Yeah, I can see he has a tight grip on it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you got rubber band together here, and I don't want the back. You want to have a uh, thing of the batteries, right? Uh, you don't have to worry about it. You can hold it. Uh, you can hold it uh, one-handed. Yeah. I do like the black better than the white. I don't know what it is. Yeah, the white is a uh, prototype protein. Yeah, yeah. He showed me that up at the uh, Springfield. He had the white one. He had it to me. Yeah. Yeah, but the final one will probably be black. Yeah, this is this is Yeah, pretty. we could have armor yellow. So you can actually throw switches with this too then if you have that program in, if you get switch machines. Yes, you can yes. do that according. So yeah. Yeah, you'll be able to do um, Are you gonna make shovel different throttles or just concentrate on one? Mm -hmm. Well the one you had in your hand earlier, that blue one, yeah. That'll be a, another version. Okay. Like we call that the mini. I kinda like I like the shape of this because it fits your hand the way it kinda capers in, yeah. It's mm -hmm. not real big. The, the 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 other one, you had one here, the these the, the, the big one, the N C E. They're a little too big for Maybe you got a huge rear with signals and all that stuff, and you know they throw it in a little bit. Mm -hmm. Are we a good? So he's going to change the backlight uh, while you're looking at it. Oh, okay. So uh, I'll let you know when it comes on. <laughs> <laughs> well, I killed the building. I'm going to cross the road. All right, should be changed. Okay. It will go off after 30 seconds. Oh, okay. I can make it longer if you want, but I thought I'd start there. There's no way to keep it on constantly. There is. No, yeah. really? We can't make it constant. Do you want it constant? Well, well it's not my... When you, your wife would have that option when you, when you put sell these. You know? <laughs> what would you like? I can do it for you. Uh, I like them all the time. You want it constant? Okay. Yeah. Okay, hold on. When you sell these all over the world. All right, so try it again. And it should stay on this time forever. Okay, I tried to bump. Yeah, that, that is that is really nice. It's impressive. Oh, right. Yeah, it's got yeah, your running. Yeah, number. Yeah. So you know which engine you're running. Yeah. And then you can put as many engineers as you want, right? By any, and you can put any name in you want. Yeah. It doesn't have to be. It could be any any uh, any number of characters. You know, you know what you're running, and line. you just have to press a button and it's already in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what happened? Uh, Short circuit. Oh, I ran into a another train. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> 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 no, I forgot he was down there switching. <laughs> what am I supposed to be controlling? Let's say we've always computed. Do you know what you're doing? 1558. Where's 1558? That's a GP7. That's that's I just took hold and hold on that one. I don't know where it's at. <laughs> it's a Boston main engine. Right here. Yeah, because that, that just happened to me. I looked down and all of a sudden I had the menu up. I like the fact that I did it without even thinking about it, that I just naturally, I never even looked at the throttle, I'm just running it. It's just, 
Just with your hand. Just with my hand, very naturally, with no, without thinking about it, I can do that. And I find myself running the training, not even really going through a training, you know, like learning curve. It's just very naturally. So just uh, by feel. Just by feel, I'm running it. Never have to look at what the throttle. Can easily find the, the direction button. You know, using the thumb wheel, very, very easy, very intuitive. And run, I could run all day and never have to look at the throttle, which is, that's the way I like, would like to run. Yeah, that's that's the way we designed it. <laughs> yeah. And that's why we have this instead of a cell phone. Yeah. Because with a cell phone, you have to look at it. Yeah. 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 After operating trains successfully for a while, we decided to start doing some stress testing. So we took the router, which had been in the same room as the model railroad, and moved it up one floor, his uh, layout is in the basement, and all the way to the other end of the house so that uh, we could have a fairly poor signal for Wi-Fi to see how all the throttles and the command station would behave with a poor Wi-Fi signal. And we moved it far enough away so that we had one bar, and as you'll see, it actually worked pretty well. It's still working though, even though it only has that one bar, it's still reasonably responsive. Uh, if you go to a, a one bar area on the quiet 34 and watch for um, the hazard throw configured, I have some configured for direction. Let me fix that if I can. Fix it to what? Uh, to show to yeah. show the next function. Is it's it's yeah. good, uh, oh, did you do that for his throttle that he was on? Early in the week, we had run into an issue with the command station, uh, and we didn't know what it was. We ran into the same issue while we're on uh, Rich's layout and we had everything with us that we needed to diagnose it. So we pulled out the equipment, well we meaning Balage and Stuart, uh, and then they uh, dug in and uh, managed to figure out exactly what was going wrong so that hopefully uh, we fixed the bug and it won't happen again. So this is a uh, short look at that. So it's enabled. Okay, what do you want next? You want to measure the gates? There's no freight customers up there. Ideal uh, would be to. Yeah, we had the feed you want the scope? We had, well, I told yeah, actually, you let's take a look at what's the, what's the output. So we probably that 22 ohm. You guys do all this in house, right? You make everything up? Is it? Yes. Board, I told me you guys do all that. Yeah, they have robots yeah. and everything. Yeah. You haven't been to the shop? You gotta go check out the shop. Yeah, but this is uh, what we do for our hobby because we, we have a passion one, about it. Mm -hmm. So we do this uh, on evenings and weekends. Okay. <laughs> so here's the yeah. Deal. So so our um, pay is we got uh, fed this week. <laughs> <laughs> Let's bring out the big guns. Whoops, yeah. <laughs> I had to make my own food last night though. <laughs> <laughs> Probably not. Oh yeah, we're good here. Okay, cool. Do that again. Come here. After we did the debugging session, we got everything back up and running and uh, ran trains for a little while. We all had a really great time. It was a lot of fun. And so here are just a few closing shots. Ah, that's a phantom. We got to figure it out. We gotta figure it out. I hope that you liked this uh, video as much as uh, we enjoyed making it. Uh, after spending a week working on the throttles in the command station, it was really quite rewarding to go out in the field and use them on an actual layout. Uh, and it was also a blast to get uh, feedback both from the layout owner, uh, Rich, and also from John Forsyth, the owner of uh, TCS. Um, as I've probably mentioned before, the throttle projects are a hobby project for uh, mainly three of us so far, although John's son, JD, is also now starting to work on uh, the, the code for this. 
I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, please subscribe and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.